Good morning, this is Brittany with New Key Realty. We are over at 16580 Hardwood Lane in St. Robert. Um, this is right off Highway Y, really great location in St. Robert. The front of the house. Nice mature landscaping. They are doing some work down the road, so we have a little bit of noise, but this is generally fairly quiet around here. You got wooded across the street. We'll do some quick house stats. Uh, this house is brand new, just listed, 189.9. It was built in 1986. It is a three bedroom, two bath, 1,484 square feet. It's on just over an acre, 1.03 acres. I will note this is owned by a licensed realtor. Um, doesn't mean too much. We do have to let you know that uh, this isn't anyone that's owned by my company or anything, um, but is by a Missouri licensed realtor. There's that gravel driveway. You do have concrete right in front of the garage. That second one car detached garage. This is going to be on public utilities. You're gonna have electric furnace, electric hot water heater. It was recently remodeled. I mean, this looks, this looks pretty fresh. Uh, let's see. They have new vinyl flooring, new carpets, and uh, they're doing a little bit of touch up still in the bathroom. So you have a little covered entryway outside light this is the view when you enter the home so you have a little bit of separation it's not just like enter bam living room a little bit of an entry you have a coat closet here behind the front door as you see there they're still working and doing touch-ups i like how they painted the closets and carried the flooring into the closets this is a gas fireplace. Big front windows. Dining and kitchen. As you can see, they do have some overhang there. So bar seating, really good size space. Very pretty granite. Lots of movement in here. You have your stainless appliances. Uh, the oven is smart. When I walked in originally, it tried to connect to my phone. So I'm not sure what a smart oven does, but <laughs> it is a smart oven. Brand new refrigerator. I mean, the appliances all look new. Oh, maybe not the dishwasher, but the fridge and oven look brand new. Laundry room right off the kitchen and the garage. Here's your hot water heater tucked away. A little bit of storage above there. Washer dryer area with storage above. Here is our garage. We have attic access. That's the back of the fireplace. It probably didn't always used to be electric. It probably was wood burning. And they finished off the laundry room so you don't have to actually go you know, into the garage per se to do laundry. Your panel box. This looks like it could be a water softener but it doesn't appear to be hooked up to anything. Not totally sure what that is. All right, let's peek out back. Let's 
So this does have an acre. Nice, peaceful. A lot of the neighbors also have that little bit of land. So you're not right on top of your neighbors. This is what I would call a Missouri flat yard. It does have a little bit of a slope, but I mean, this is, this is pretty flat. The deck looks to be new. This looks like it's new wood. That's probably why it's not stained because you have to wait a couple months to stain the new wood. Kind of digging the blue. It's different. I like it. All right, let's check out those bedrooms and bathrooms. So we had coat closet. All right, little furnace, furnace closet. Bedroom one. This does overlook the front yard. Good size closet. Again, we've carried the flooring into the closets, like it, bathroom. I think this is the room that said they have some touch-ups. You can see right there, some drywall touch-ups. I don't know if the plan is to do another level of the backsplash or just painting, but they said this would be touched up. So again, we have some very pretty countertops in here. Nice mirror, not just, you know, builder basic. Looks like we got some touch up paint going on. Tub shower combo. They said they would be installing the shower bar. Nice seamless flooring. The second, the secondary bedroom. also overlooks the front yard. Decent, decent size. You could definitely fit a, a full, probably a queen size bed in here. The newer carpet. That appears to be an access panel for probably the bathroom over there. Here's the hall closet. It's actually pretty deep. You definitely could fit uh, the vacuum in here, towels, what have you. And again, carried the flooring. It's a nice touch. Master bedroom. Nice windows overlooking the backyard. And uh, this is this is definitely a good size space. You definitely could fit probably a king bed on that wall or, you know, either of these two balls. Closet. It is a walk-in. I mean, it's not a gigantic walk-in, but for a house of this age, this is this is a decent size walk-in. Let's check out that master bath. Got the vinyl flooring in here. Again, pretty countertops, the vanity. They did mention a mirror. It is probably this white one right there. Tub shower combo. Not a gigantic room, but I mean, it is nice to have a bathroom attached to your master. And then a little window to uh, look out back. All right, this is hardwood. I know it's already getting quite a bit of attention, so I'll get this uploaded ASAP and sent out to you. Thanks, have a great evening.